Well, firefighters staying very busy with the investigation into this massive building fire in a dense part of Seattle. Uh, Fox 13's Jennifer Dowling is in Belltown for us. She's been there all morning following this. How, how are we doing out there right now, Jennifer? Well, things are looking good. We've had some crew members leave the area, some of the fire crews, and they've got a good handle on this. There's still a ladder truck here, a Belltown ladder that's uh, monitoring the situation. They were putting some foam on the backside of the building about half an hour ago. Um, trying to uh, just kind of tamp down on those hot spots, but the uh, fire suppression efforts are going really well. Um, this was fully involved this morning, this fire. Uh, the flames were shooting from the roof at about 4 a.m., 5 a.m., a very, very active fire, and crews were able to uh, get here, and it took a couple hours to knock it down, but they were able to do it, and right now uh, we're looking at the aftermath. It is just a charred hull of a building. We talked to a lot of neighbors in the area who came out to watch it while it was burning, and they were really sad. Uh, to see it go. There were some establishments here, uh, some dive bars that they remember that were really fun. And also there were some funky studios in the uh, burn building and they just had a lot of good memories. Uh, we talked to one woman who feels that uh, what will happen to this property is predetermined, but she told us what she would like to see built here in the future. I'd like to see affordable housing because this neighborhood used to be very affordable and wonderful and diverse and it had all kinds of little independent shops and that's all going away and I know things change but that's really sad. So that's the sentiment of some of the neighbors here. Uh, really sad to see it go. They know this will probably become a large building or something but uh, as Trixie said she'd like it to see it become affordable housing. So lots of uh, lots of opinions. I'm going to toss it back to you in the studio.